I was really excited when I read the script. Uh, definitely, I had I didn't really know where they were gonna take it because they, the playing field was so open they could have done anything with the character. But I was really happy as an actor because um, I felt like I could I, I I got a chance to play a lot of different colors. Well. The thing that people forget is that both of these guys are dealing with serious traumatic um, issues, um, post-traumatic issues, and guilt uh, issues. <laughs> um, Steve is haunted by the fact that he never went after Bucky when, when Bucky fell off the train. Um, and he's, he suffers from survivor's guilt, and in a way it's a little bit of that, uh, similar to a person who whose family member goes missing and they never really settle, you know, they never, they don't know, they don't really kind of settle into what really happened. Um, and I think it's similar like that for Steve and, and also that he feels responsible for it. And of course for Bucky Barnes, he's on another level because he's learning about what a killing machine he's been and how much damage he's done across the years. I mean, I just, I love Chris. He's, he's, he's awesome. I mean, he's an incredibly generous actor. He, um, and he's, he's game to try something, you know, he's game, you know, he, he'll go there with you. Like he'll, um, he'll want to find a cool moment in the scene. He's, uh, he's open to ideas. I mean, he's, um, you know, you, it's good in these movies to, f you want to feel like, in my opinion, that you're on a team, that you're working together towards making an, a, a cool, a cool project, so to speak. And, and you definitely feel that with, with Chris. 